Hi, this is Phoenix Genesis for PhoenixGenesis.com and our two YouTube channels, Phoenix Genesis and Frag Camp. We're playing Minecraft on PlayStation 4, my Phoenix Genesis survival world with a natural texture pack. And we're back at the main train station. I've been showing you different rooms. And let's jump through the uh, nether portal here. We've already uh, did a room tour of this room. Um, please check it out on my YouTube channel. Let's jump in and just look at uh, my little nether... Um, fortress station so I got really lucked out on the Phoenix Genesis seed um, uh, it right at spawn you just go a few feet and uh, I built this train station I jumped in the nether portal uh, built the nether portal jumped in and it came right to um, the blazes and some um, and some nether ward farms so what I did here was uh, I like to segregate my um, my uh, nether fortress so things don't come in and kill me uh, right now I'm in survival peaceful to show the video so what I did was I just made some stone brick here and made doors on each of these uh, d uh, intersections here and these are just different hallways in the um, nether fortress and then I like the label so this tells you it goes to my mushroom farm it goes to my nether ward farm and it goes to one of the blaze spawners I have two here then I just did this nice um, carpet out of uh, black wool green wool and gray wool just kind of a nice pattern I think it uh, picks up nicely with the uh, purple um, nether portal, so it's made out of obsidian. Then I always like to grow nether, so um, nether wart. So here's some soul sand nether wart that I got from a giant soul sand nether wart farm I found out here. And again, more uh, labeling. This is another blaze spawner, and you get glowstone as well, so, and you get blaze. So I labeled that, and we have some cauldrons here, so I can do some brewing. And over here, I just uh, sealed all this in with. Um, with uh, stone bricks because it's fire resistant and then just a little ladder to go out here to see what's uh, happening out here. Come on, jump, jump, jump up and a little trap door. And I always like to have a top level. I, I wall all in my escape routes to my next nether portal so I can fast track through the nether. nether. I need to finish building this up. So I'll make one as a train. Uh, probably the top one will be all sealed in as a train and then the bottom will be a walkway or vice versa. And um, there's my blaze spawners over here and I have another one over here and you can kind of see down into the nether. So that's what I do my in my netherland world. You'll see I built a giant um, nether uh, palace and I just really haven't explored um, I have explored the nether I take that back but I just haven't really built in it I've been building too much in the overworld but we will build this up as well so here I just use some iron I like kind of that uh, separation but I still wanted to keep this open because it's pretty small and just the essentials um, this painting was uh, originally in the um, nether portal on the other side in the overworld so I just kind of put it here I think the dark colors go well and I just left the nether rack here and I put some glowstone underneath just to kind of light this up and um, indented this with some glowstone and I've got fully functional furnaces, some brewing stands and then of course a crafting table, an anvil, a regular chest and an ender chest. So just kind of some essentials uh, to, to prepare and this is my downstairs. We'll just go down here and do some cobblestone stairs and I got a um, pig. I'll show you. I kind of rescued him from the, uh, he was precariously balanced on some glowstone and I decided to put him here and he was kind of going up the stairs and uh, this kind of keeps him out once in a while. Hey, Diablo. So I named him Diablo. Isn't that awful? Um, the devil. Uh, well, Nether does kind of look like hell. And this is my nice viewing area. I just put some glass in here. And I just love this. And um, kind of carved out this lava and put glass here. And uh, this is where fire resistance potion really comes in handy. And see my Stay Frosty Trophy and Achievement video I just put up. And also how to make a fire resistant potion. Because, yes, the f lava was coming through here a lot. So that's really helps you to build that and I threw up another funky painting and just some uh, glowstone I just kind of wanted to keep it kind of rough and this is just different materials that I, I'm going to need while I'm building and also for uh, making some potions some golden apples are good for fire resistance and glistening apples and again this goes up to the top because I like multiple escape routes and if we go down here might as well take there isn't too much more I'm still working on this more nether um, wart because that's always handy in any of the corners we can more another observation and this comes down here again I'm going to um, build walkways and um, rail for this and this is uh, already naturally done this is my giant lava pool and I absolutely love this um, I actually uh, carved all the way around so uh, I did travel pretty far and um, found those giant soul sand uh, 
you know, farms. But this is where I can get lava for my house easily. So you just bring some buckets down, you get that lava, and you bring it back up, and it fuels your um, furnaces in the nether and also um, also in my uh, main train station. So I love these viewing areas. Got Look at the nether. It's so much fun. Um, uh, oh, you should see my night vision video, too. That was pretty cool where I was running around the nether with, in night vision. Uh, that's another potion that comes in very handy in the nether. So fire resistance potion, night vision potion. Stock up on those and bring them down here when you come in here. Hey, Daddy Diablo. Oink, oink. So that's it. And that was pretty short. I hope you enjoyed my um, kind of mini nether fortress that I have. And uh, definitely you need to have some kind of protection when you go in the nether. Uh, otherwise, you're just going to... Um, die right away like I did uh, in my netherland. Oh, I was just precariously balanced on this little uh, island over lava. It was horrible. And um, anyway, that's it. Oops. Always make sure my doors are shut. And yes, eventually I'll see all this in. And this goes to um, my uh, Art Deco village. So, and